And now, turn your attention to the prophetess who was a spiritual mother to the master prophet, a woman of great prophetic intelligence and understanding, the late prophetess Loretta Taylor. Hallelujah. We said we're complaining because we only have one or two suits. I seem the time, you know how I knew I was dressed? I had on my Sunday coat because I ironed it Saturday night and put a hat on on Sunday. That's what made it my Sunday coat. But God was God then. And I may have one or two changes now, and he's still God. It's not by might or power. Oh, God saying, hear me this morning. My God, in this 40 minutes, hear what the Lord is saying to you. He's, he's wrecking, moving, and making changes in your lives. So many of you have directional changes. And you say, no, God, how will I know? What will I do? Whatever. You're going to know. Hallelujah. When you leave out of this place, you're going to know. Hallelujah. If a prophet prophesied to you, if they don't, you're going to know. Hallelujah. For I am the Lord thy God. I am the Lord thy God. And what somebody don't tell you, the Holy Spirit will make it known. But God brought you here that he might talk to you. That he might open your understanding. That your eyes might be enlightened. And that you might be whole as glory in the land of the living. It's not by might. It's not by power. Hello, I'm Master Prophet Ibrahim Andrew, and I would like to say thank you for coming and thank you for watching this video presentation. We want to honor those that have gone before us because our future is only as great as our past. Many times people forget to salute the heroes and salute the individuals that makes the difference in our life. And because of that, we miss out on such rich heritage. The prophetic is a legacy that must continue. And because of that, we want to honor them. There are many members of POEM that has made their transition and have gone on to be with the Lord, that have sacrificed their lives, relationships, friendships, to become connected in the prophetic. And when you begin to become connected in the prophetic, it's a lonely road. It is not a road that a lot of people begin to celebrate. A matter of fact, a lot of critics will begin to criticize you as to who are you to speak the word of the Lord or to hear the mind of God. But I want to say that the spirit of the Lord comes upon me saying that you are going to see a rising up of the voice of the prophets and the company of prophets that will emerge. And there shall be a generation that shall reach out and extend their hands to the prophetic voice in this hour. And you will see the day emerge where you will hear people coming from many different nations asking, where are the prophets? For the hour is upon us to begin to embrace the next move of what the Spirit of God is doing. And even in this hour, I'm going to bring closure to the past and I'm opening up the doors for a new generation to emerge. You are now in the hour of the finest time in history. For history is in the making. For you will rejoice that you have seen this day for many will envy that you are living in this day and this day they could not see. But I will say unto you, that you will see days emerging where your ancestors shall look upon thee and say the race is worth it. For I am calling forth a generation of prophetic voices and mouthpieces that will speak on my behalf and bring forth my glory in the earth so it can be seen. You will see government topple you will see industries topple. You will see things on earth and you will see the emerging of a new economy. Even in America, there shall be a great shaking. And even in the shaking and in the midst of the fallout, I am bringing forth a greater glory than that which you've ever seen. Ready yourself for a move of my spirit 
and you will begin to see that that which has been a mountain shall now be made low and you will begin to see the hand of the Lord in your midst, saith the Spirit of the living God. So, prepare your hearts and minds for the move of my Spirit. Prepare your ears to hear the word of the Lord. Prepare your eyes to see the mind of God in this hour. And in this hour, you shall be empowered and you shall be a participator in the next visitation that is coming on the horizon. This visitation will not be stopped. This visitation will not be hindered. This visitation will come forth in a way that you have never known. And you will begin to embrace that which I am bringing forth. The hour of my hand is upon thee for greatness. And you shall start to embrace each other and the greatness shall begin to emerge. Prepare for the emerging of a new day, for you are about to see my hand and the unfolding of my plan, saith the Spirit of the living God. God bless you. Thank you for being a part of this video presentation as we've celebrated those that are in the prophetic cloud of witnesses. God bless you and peace.